Judge Ronald Hendricks largely accepted the testimony of the one and only state witness, Bonakele Pakisi, who said he had seen Matlomula being thrown from the vehicle, after which he too was kidnapped and assaulted. The two accused were convicted of murder and other lesser charges, and their bail consequently lapsed in terms of Section 58 of the Criminal Procedure Act. The case was postponed to early next year for sentencing, and Dwarvart and Skita remanded in custody. About two weeks ago, their legal team filed an urgent application, according to Section 60 of the Criminal Procedure Act, to bring a new bail application before court pending their sentencing. The state opposed the application, saying that the court did not have the jurisdiction to review the decision of the trial court. Acting Judge Daniel Matlapeng ruled that according to Section 60 of the Criminal Procedure Act, the men may not apply for bail after their conviction. He found that Hendricks could have extended their bail if he wanted to, but that his ruling that their bail be revoked was in effect a court order, which will stand unless challenged on appeal. Duervart and Skeeter will be sentenced on the 28th and 29th January.